gonna try this now. Let me switch on over. Elsinore. Let's see, it does have a category. Nice. Uh, wherefore art thou, Elsinore? That's how you spelled out. So we uh we don't know anything about this. Stay awake, peer pressure. I need some peer pressure to stay awake. Because usually I have caffeine every day, but I have not had caffeine uh, today. So do, I guess, do you want to listen to the game or should I listen to the you game? You should listen to the game. Okay, cool. I'm gonna, you know, call me if it's particularly cool and interesting. Wow. Okay. <coughs> you are going to go watch the stream. Okay. Maybe we won't. Ignore me, please. Yeah. No actual peer pressure. Get some rest. Um, sleep is good. I need to get my headphones working. Genna is, uh, maybe we won't call him back. Maybe he just doesn't get to enjoy this with us, you know? If he's gonna ditch the stream. All right, let's see, I downloaded this earlier. Um, so this will be fun. But let me just, I just have to uh, turn the Bluetooth off on my phone so that I can make sure I can connect easily on my computer so I can get this working. Cool. Let me just, because I want to hear if there's any cool music. Yeah, none of the cool kids listen to peer pressure. I am obviously the master of what the cool kids do. I, uh, you know. I was one of the coolest kids in, in school. Gunna was the coolest kid in his IB program. <laughs> I, I'm just jealous because my school didn't have an IB program. If you leave stream early, you get roasted, Gunna. Not, not people who leave from chat early. You guys come and go as you please. You know, live your life. Let me see. All right, we seem to have connected. Groovy. Let me make sure y'all are hearing the same things that I am hearing. Do do do. I wanna wait for our lives to be over. Okay, cool. Right now I'm not hearing anything, so don't worry about it. You're just hearing the sweet vocal stylings of me. And I guess I'll turn this up. Y'all can tell me. Oh yeah, what was his extended essay topic? Gena, what was your extended essay topic in IB? The people, inquiring minds want to know. The people demand to know. I did a chem internship and just talked about that. Okay, that's not, that seems correct. That seems reasonable. Like, what would have happened? All right, let's see. So, Elsinore is starting. Infinite recursion. Okay, it's going to start. We're pulling it up. Oh, pretty. Interesting. I hope she doesn't jump into the water and die. Ophelia. Oh no, it is Ophelia. I am concerned. I remember we made t-shirts that said one sleepless <laughs> night is a tragedy, a million is IB. Our IB coordinator said we could either include the IB logo or attribute the quote to Stalin, but not both. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's very funny. Um, yeah, we just had AP at my school. So, you know, not as fancy as y'all. Oh. Let me just make sure I've got chat over here with me so I can see y'all better. So, I'm already concerned. Uh, because Ophelia does not have a good fucking time in Hamlet. But let's find out. I assume we'll have a chance maybe to... Aw, uh, no, we're fucking ignoring you, Polonius, because you're a scrub. Hello, father. That's better. And what are you doing all the way out here, contemplating suicide? Um, she vetoed our earlier proposal of IB, therefore IBS. I was wondering if that pun came up. I wanted to be alone for a while. It's quiet here, and Hamlet's fucking annoying. I see. Avoiding me more like. We'll have a small fa Okay. Should I do voices for all the characters? I'm gonna fucking ruin my- ruin my, uh, voice that's already fucked, but- Avoiding me more like. 
Well, I've got a small fit. He wouldn't have that that accent. He would have like a fancy one. Polonius. Well, I mean, obviously they're all in, they're all fucking Danish. So I don't know how to do a Danish accent. I have no idea how to do a Danish accent. All I, that just makes me think of Mads Mikkelsen, who I'm in love with because we're watching Hannibal right now. Your brother's in the throne room visiting the king. Now the question is, is the king uh, Hamlet Sr.? Or is the king... Oh, has that already gone down? Okay. At this rate, he'll go to Paris with nothing but the clothes on his back. Oh. That would come as no surprise to either of us. Aw, oh, they're talking about how much they're gonna miss Laertes. You, me, and Hideo Kojima have that in common. We're talking about being in love with Mads Mikkelsen from Handgas <laughs> of Hannibal? I feel like a lot, a lot of people are in love with him. Apparently, yeah. but the show's like old now, I guess. I'm just getting to it. Oh, we're watching it slowly. War brewing! Oh, your hair was already white, bud. You're old. Father. I'll fetch Laertes. Why can't he just go get him? Why does he have to go get me to go get him? My thanks. Does he have a little belly? That's cute. <laughs> this is why you're my favorite daughter. Yes, and Hugh Dancy is so pretty when he is in distress. Okay, yes, also, I just want to, like, I just want to hug them. I want to be their friend, even though that would turn out poorly for me, probably. Like, what a, <laughs> what cuties. Am I right? And that as well. Amazing. Wow, he just fucking booked it. I didn't expect him to move so fast. All right. Okay. We got to find... She's learned about herself. That's neat. All right, here's my journal. <sighs> now, my question is, am I now responsible for making sure that Hamlet does not turn into the clusterfuck that is the play Hamlet? Like, am I going to try to make it like a, like a nicer ending for this shit? Because honestly, I, if that's the goal, then I'm just going to get in a, on a fucking boat and leave. Um... All right, so I've got to find Laertes here. I know some characters. Um, aw. Everything I know, the world. I guess she's like, I can't leave. What would I do? I guess that's a good point. You can be a bit addle-brained. Aw. Cute. All right, we've got some hearsay. Okay, this is like... Okay, this is things I can tell people. Nito, it's some fun, some fucking gossip. Nice, Horatio. What's up, man? Horatio. Hey, L Horatio, can you fucking help me out? Ah. Uh huh. No, do not compare me to a summer's day. I have other shit going on. I'm saying nothing. Okay, hmm. cool. You flatterer. Hey, Horatio. I hope that all of us don't die and you're left by yourself. A professional friend? Yes. Aw. Yeah, he's, he's just like Hamlet's bud. I mean, that, that courtier, that's what that is. <sighs> okay, he was not helpful. All right, court's being held in the Great Hall. Cool, he was... Uh, it's great. I think I'm gonna have to single-handedly stop the play Hamlet from happening. Oh, no. Hmm. Um, Horatio is trying to hit on me. And he, now he's talking about when he studied abroad, which is annoying. <laughs> Meals are six hours long. I'd be much slower and larger. Yeah, me too, man. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Horatio from? Horatio now believes me. Okay. That's cool. Let's see what we know about Horatio. Hamlet's schoolmate. Okay, cool. Uh, he can't be Danish, but I've never known his origin. Served as a soldier in the last war. 
Alonso Bernardo. Um, okay. They're, ah, they're in the Great Hall, trying to get permission to leave. Okay, should I talk to Marcellus, or should I just, like, move on with my life? Hey, bro! I'm gonna pretend Marcellus. like Horatio didn't just tell me all the information that I need. <gasps> Why are you so upset? Are you okay, man? I'm sorry. You gave me a bit of a spook! Been on edge since last night! Just, a uh, a difficult night's watch. You look like you've seen a ghost, Marcellus. I'm sorry to have troubled you. <laughs> Been up a little too late playing cards again, have we? No! no not at all! <laughs> Irma cleaned me out after the last game, and I haven't gone back to her for a game since. I've got some vague Scottish going on. Well, that accurate. Accurate to what? Somebody who's heard a, Scot a Scotsman once, and, yeah, like, and then had a concussion and thinks they're Scottish. Oh, Marcellus. Oh, no, like, I was gonna say... That's what I was uh, saying, that's what I was talking about. Hannibal. Bram Stoker. Bram Stoker? <laughs> yes, famous, uh, accurate reporter of Scottish accents and stuff. Bram St Dracula is really just... Uh... Bram Stoker mocking the poor. Like, that yes. is that is what the book really is. It's, like, the only funny parts of the book are, like, whenever anybody who's not rich talks and they have the most fucking silly accents ever. Yeah. And they, they're everything they say is ridiculous. Yeah. I like mm -hmm. that guy who like loves the wolf. I think I lost two viewers with that accent I just did. Wow. Damn. <laughs> Hashtag rebuild Adrian's wall. Keep them out. <laughs> I won't tell if you won't. Am I flirting with Marcellus? Don't give him false hope, Ophelia. Ah. Exit? That's funny. Scotland exit? I mean, they tried. There was like a memorandum 2009 or something? I'm not sure. They like did a vote like in this century for Scotland to leave, but it, of course it didn't win. But you never know. Scotland rejoins the EU and England cries forever. Honestly, pl the plot twist we're all waiting for. All right, we're we're going to get formal permission. Yeah, well. Hmm. I like yes. this pretty. In the great, look at look at how. What is this pose? This is very silly. I see. Very dramatic. <laughs> Are you just trying to be helpful, or okay? Nice. Everybody believes this. I hope I'm not doing something bad. How do I get to the Great Hall? Oh, I guess it's probably the thing that is purple. Oh, there's other ladies here! No, I guess I'll come back to them later. Um, is that rude? Is that sick? Oh, Jesus Christ, this is ominous. Why is it so ominous in here? Bernardo is talking to... What? Ah, right. Completely forgotten. My mind's on Paris already. Hamlet and I are both waiting for an audience with the king. Let's strike the Hmm. Okay. Nice. We're gonna try to get the queen. I talk to Hamlet. Okay, so it's already King Claudius. I can listen yes. to this event. Mental test failed? Damn, well no, it would have been failed anyway, because the only thing I was allowed to say was, my dad is looking for Laertes, like that's the only thing I'm allowed to say. Again, it says I only have one viewer, so I guess you've logged off, you big jerk. One woman says to the other, have you heard about this Bechtel test thing? And her friend replies, yeah, my boyfriend was telling me about it. Aww. Come on, that's a 
good joke. It was, I laughed. <laughs> we'll fight him head on. Why would you bring up your brother? That's awkward. May he rest in peace. Oh, Bernardo's a hunk! Who is Ber I don't even remember Bernardo from Hamlet, but look at that. Look at that slice of pound gate. Yes. Hamlet is so sad! Hamlet! <laughs> Why is Hamlet the one I want to marry? Look at this sad bitch. It's fucking tragic. <laughs> Why is he like, yes, yes, my brother's past. You're the one who brought him up. Nobody else brought him up, bro. Jesus Christ, you guys are... He's weird. Alright, let's see what we have learned about these motherfuckers. Oh, wait, they're still chatting. Okay, so let's see. Bernardo. You're gonna get your ass kicked by four guys. Already these reactions are a delight. I'm glad. I'm glad you're enjoying. Uh, like I just... Because <laughs> there's so much drama going on here, right? Also, Hamlet looks like a sad bitch. Um, no, it's just like, don't throw us into a war we don't need, man. Gertrude really flaunting what her mama gave her over there. I don't want to, you know... I'm just saying, that is low cut. Really suggesting that you are not going to do good. King Claudius now believes that the court has been successfully informed. Informed that he's gonna fucking start a war. Incredible. Let's go talk. Well, let's look at the. Let's see. Let's look at the characters we learned about. Oh, Hamlet. Former paramour. Oh, I guess. I thought at the start of Hamlet, like, we're still, like, in. In our defense, we are moving from above. That is true. It's just, they're very shiny. I guess that looks a little more modest. Like, she's still, you know, showing off her wares, but then that's the only thing you put into the rest of the outfit. <coughs> <coughs> Completely obscures your body. You know, you do what you can. Well, the queen gets the longest thing. Like, look at how much Hamlet gets, and look how much the queen gets. As is traditional? That is traditional. She remarried to the king's brother after his death. Is that traditional for Denmark? And why was Hamlet such a little bitch about it? I mean, I guess it is traditional for, like, other people to inherit in certain ways, but then they still, like, it's still not okay to, like, kill your predecessor. Aww. She's, like, my surrogate mother. Remember the Habsburgs? Holy shit, her father is the Emperor Maximilian? Does that even work for like when Hamlet was supposed to have taken place? Incredible. Wow, what a fancy bitch. Ah, Hamlet starts in an off again phase. Usually the turnaround is much longer, but also he was not taking a somewhat inspected thing well. Right. He was saying that he was mad that they got married so quickly, but it is, like, not weird that it happened. It's, like, maybe a little weird that they, like, got to it so fast. Right. Though many find him ignorant, arrogant. Not ignorant. We don't know about ignorance yet. Let's see. What about this? <coughs> <coughs> oh, let's see. Where is Jesus, my brother? He gets to go to Paris, and I get to fucking stay here with Dad. Sucks. Hamlet hates him. Why are they going to Paris together? I think that it's sadder for Hamlet and Laertes to, like, I mean, I guess that. Like, I think it's sadder if they don't hate each other being, but I can't actually remember what their relationship was like at the beginning of Hamlet. I imagine that's just like, Laertes is kind of mad, I think, that Hamlet's ignoring his sister. Claudius is the most revered soldier. We should marry Bernardo. All I'm saying, 
All I'm saying is look at Bernardo and look at Hamlet. Look at Bernardo, look at Hamlet. One of these Yeah, but you asked an English major to play a game based on Hamlet. I am going to nitpickingly <laughs> compare everything about this game to Hamlet. I understand it's probably more of an inspired by situation. Um, all I'm saying is this guy looks like a competent military man with a jaw that could crack your back as it were. And this guy looks like a complaining elf. Oh wait, I also got some hearsay. No, there was a different thing. No? Okay. My lord. The Prince of Norway demands we surrender. Oh, dramatic. I'm gonna talk to him. Celebration because Hamlet's leaving. Mm. Okay. We're just gonna ignore At once, my lord. that that'll work well. That'll really that'll really now ease then. the situation. Alright, let's see. Larity's in Hamlet. Cool, I, I hurried this along excuse the yawning. Mm-hmm. My king. Clarities is fucking off to Paris. I want to go. I want to go. Oh, he wants to go to Wittenberg. <laughs> These Danish walls are absolutely miserable. This little fucking edge lord. Mm. I am done with Hamlet. Okay. They're not. Like, how young are they? Like, I feel like at this time you could send somebody off when they were like 14. Alright. Hamlet, on the other hand, your dad's dead. <laughs> so, well, I get to decide. <laughs> Absolutely not. Oh, no. Rude. Well, because he thinks that Hamlet is going to organize an army and attempt to take over. And attempt to take over. What? <laughs> You're stuck here, you whiny bitch. Why are you still mourning? Ugh. Hamlet. Mm-hmm. It weird. Claudius, weird. Weird. You're making it worse. <laughs> to be like your dad is dead. I am daddy now. That is weird. You're being weird. You can't yes. just scream at someone whose dad died two months ago. I am daddy now. Okay, for your own health. I don't think it's for his own health. Claudius being fucking weird. Aww. Excellent. I don't have a choice either, bitch. You don't see me moping about it, except I have been moping about it quite a bit, actually. All right, court is dismissed. <laughs> Laird Look at Laird's stupid, smug fucking smile. Claudius to the ghost. Your son calls me daddy, too? <laughs> yeah. Little rude. Everyone you loved calls me daddy now. Of course. 
You are most what? Is that what I should name the like highlight of this in the stream? Like, your son calls me daddy now. All right, swift travels, Lair. To just really rub it Ophelia. in Hamlet's face. Okay, let's see. Okay, Hamlet. Oh, Hamlet wants to avoid them. Hamlet now believes that he is staying in Denmark. Okay, what is happening Hamlet. now? I am just eavesdropping the fuck out of these people. Hmm. Aww. My son. There's such a darkness within him. Is this The Sims? This looks like The Sims Medieval. It does kind of look like The Sims Medieval, which I really wish we had gotten to work. I think this one's a little, uh, a little more uh, visual novelly than that, but it is. I he no no this is Danish not Simlish easy mistake to make lol I wish we had gotten the Sims Medieval to work I would have played the shit out of that <sighs> my dear uh oh I learned more about Lady Brit and Irma how I didn't even fucking talk oh. to her okay All right please. I'm her lady in waiting of House Brock and the Horse. House Brock and House? She could probably just set up Brock and Horse. Let's see. The Simlish, my favorite pastry. Gordon Simlish, is that anything? I don't know what you're. Gordon Danish, is that a thing? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Is that anything? Gordon Lish? A beautiful face, but an ugly soul. That's all you are, Irma says, with this fucking satisfied smile. Spare me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Lady Brit. Why are these two hanging out? This is where the real drama is. Fuck Hamlet's bullshit. Lady Brit and Irma are going at each other's fucking throats. <laughs> I bathe the queen. Okay, Irma. I'll watch over her until you finally kill me, Lady Brit, for me being an asshole oh, to you. Yeah. Oh, shit. They're gonna fucking go- Oh, <laughs> they're jealous about their relationship with the queen. Okay, they're like fighting over like relationship with the queen. Let me look real quick. I learned more things. Oh, okay. So I know the king denied Hamlet's request. So I could say that to people now if I really want to spread that around. Okay. Oh, uh, now Laertes wants to see me before he goes and talks to Papa. We have Irma. Are these people organized by... No, not by rank, but, like, import... I guess, like, importance to the story, almost. It seems like... Almost by rank. But, like, how... It's almost like by how Ophelia would have ranked them. Irma is one of the most feared women in Elsinore. Oh, Gertrude's from Bohemia. That's fun. Despite her teeth. Hmm. She loves to gamble, and she's quite good. Oh, she's the castle cook? And an attendant on Her Majesty? That's unlikely. The cooks and, like, the lady. Like, a queen would never talk to, like, the cook. I just find that unlikely. I mean... Uh, I do see, like, if she if somebody was her wet nurse and she remained an, on staff, it is possible. Because, like, like, yeah, if there was, like, a favorite servant in a queen's house when she was just a princess or just, like, a, a, a like, you know, a little baby, then, you know, she would have kept her on in some fashion and they would have, like, retained a relationship. But she wouldn't, like, be an official attendant. I'm not sure, like, my, any of my opinions are here, uh, is basically just based on English history, so I, I'm not sure about Danish. It might have had more relaxed rules. Plus, attendant and lady in waiting are different. No, but, like, at the level of queen, not really. Like, if you're, like, hanging out with the queen, like, you're, you're, like, ladies in waiting and, like, the maids in waiting... Like, the point is that noble families are serving you. 
that they are like subservient to you. So I, I mean, I'm not saying it's impossible. It just, it seems, uh, it, it scans as unlikely to me, especially like with the cook, who would like usually the cook to cook for this many people would not have enough time to like hang out, hang out with the queen. Is like the other thing. Like the cook was definitely like a full time job. But again, I don't know what the courtly rules in Denmark would have been, and also. It's really hard to tell exactly when Ham when Hamlet is based because it's like only loosely based on like anything historical, like even the Shakespeare version. Oh, we've never gone along. Like, look at this. This girl is is a bitch. Like, this is what in any movie or anything, the the girl who looks like this is a bitch. <coughs> 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 Okay, so here we go, and we've got some more hearsay. We know Hamlet is staying, and he would really like. I don't even want to talk to these hoes. Let's Captain. see what this is going on over here. What have you told uh, the king? Nothing yet, naturally. Hmm. Oh, wait, Marcellus and Bernardo are the guys at the beginning of Hamlet, I think, hmm. who see the ghost. I knew Marcellus was. But, like, Marcellus tells Bernardo to, like, hey, come hang out. Oh, all we can do is wait on Hamlet's word? Huh. Right. They're hoping that the ghost doesn't come back. I remember now. Please. Let's keep eavesdropping! Let's keep eavesdropping! Jesus. Oh, Hamlet. Jesus Christ. This is hell. He does have a pretty voice. He's the angsty teenager in this version. The world is not flat, Hamlet. It's round. Hamlet? We'll drink to your- <laughs> Hamlet, listen, bro. It'll be okay. We'll just get fucking crunk this evening and you'll feel better. I really think it would have been better for them to let him go. Like, I would have totally been like, all right, go ahead. I know that, like, it's a... I mean, I guess no, because it's a bad political move to let the, like, primary competition for the throne, like, leave and potentially, like, form a foreign force in order to invade. So, yeah, I guess I would also be like, you have to stay here, but it's a bummer, because he's going to be a little sad bitch. We just got to get turned. Oh, well, they do at some point. That is all Rosengrads and Guildenstern thing. Yes, they, they are eventually like, just get him the fuck out of here. <laughs> but, because they're like, he is too sad, and I think planning on killing us or himself. So I wonder if, like, it would have just been better to be, like, go, and he would have just, like, moped in Germany for a while. Mother. Aww. Wow, okay, Hamlet. Guess we know how you really feel. Wow. Disgusting. Okay. Oh. Okay. Huh. She cannot afford her grief. And your uncle is a legally required match. Huh. All right, elf boy, he's being really rude. For, okay, we're just also gonna be misogynist. <laughs> <laughs> Get up off the floor now! <laughs> Horatio's trying to be such a bro. He's trying to be helpful. He's like, let's not be silly. Do I want to talk to any of these bitches? Oh, oh. Hamlet. Oh, okay. We're doing this again. Hmm. Oops. My son. <clears throat> He's clearly just fucking depressed. My dear. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. We've already heard all of these conversations. I get the gist. We're gonna leave. My thanks. Oh, okay. Now, they've been standing there for an hour? It's fucking rude of that king. I guess kings don't <laughs> give a shit. You just have to wait for them. Aw. I sensed you needed rescuing. 
Um, you didn't. Your dad sent you. <laughs> I like that everyone's like, well, at least we've gotten through the hardest part. <laughs> and Hamlet's like, guess what, psych? <laughs> Not. <laughs> He's like, ready for it to get way harder. Ah! The, like, music came in because he's going to miss me. Aww. Is this like the Folgers commercial? is it takes a while to get over losing a parent like I know I know I've been like Hamlet you are a whiny bitch but like uh I like everybody's like why is he fine and I get I don't know maybe people like were just expected to get over things faster but at least it like it's just weird to me because in the Regency era at least in the Regency era you were expected to be in mourning for a year <laughs> so the fact that they're like, it's been two months, seems weird, especially for a king. I guess they generally... That is true, though, that people generally move faster for, like, in technically for, like, royal mornings, because you want the uh, perception of continuity. So they're actually, like, the whole court would be in mourning, yeah, for a month. I guess that's true. There is a difference between still being sad and having being sad be your full-time job and only personality trait. That is also a very good point. So yeah, I guess it is pretty standard for like a royal morning to be like a month. And then when the next person is coronated, you're supposed to kind of try to get on with things. Mm. Oh, Laertes is like Hamlet. understandable. It's understanding. Kind of making Hamlet seem like an a-hole, like a moody little boy. But he does, like, he looks like a teenager. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So everyone's like, this is normal. It is a major middle finger to a king to be like, ooh, we miss the old guy. Yeah. Different rules. That is true. Different rules. This is this is pretty standard. There's different rules for kings, especially if it's normal. So, like, Hamlet is just being a dick about something that everybody is, like, expected. Laertes. Throw shoes. Those horrible little boys who push you down. Of course. I like that they do look like brother and sister. Like, you can see these two being related. Aww. Ophelia, I, I hope that in this version of this story you can fend for yourself. Because I will feel very sad if I fuck this up but you kill yourself. <laughs> Maybe she pretends to kill herself, and then we escape. <laughs> we escape and go to Paris. That's what I hope happens. Aww. They must, uh, well, I guess they do kind of look like their dad. Like, her face kind of looked like Polonius. They're just like Tanner. Father. And Laertes looks like a lot taller, but then again, Polonius is pretty. My old. son! Aww. As usual, I've packed nothing at all until the very eve of my departure. What? Is this like a rule you have, Laertes? Nice. Farewell. 
All right. Good. I hope we don't have to listen to Polonius. Do it. Be, be neither a borrower or a lender, be. Okay. Be careful. Oh. Prince Hamlet is poison to a young woman like you. He's going to inherit the crown someday. That's another thing, too, is, like, by this, by his uncle, like, his uncle is actually, like, like, he's getting power because Hamlet's dad died. But he's also basically ensuring, we assume, because his mom only had Hamlet. So, like, the, like you, would, you would assume that she's not going to have more kids. So he's also a, a, assuring by marrying her, almost, like, almost definitely, unless she dies too, that, like, he's never going to have any children to carry on. So, like, Hamlet is, like, definitely going to inherit. Um, but I guess that's not what Hamlet's, like, super mad about. I think Hamlet's more mad about the whole marrying my mom thing, even though that was, like, apparently almost legally required. <laughs> Ophelia. Hmm. Why, why can't she hang out with him? What, yeah, why specifically her? <sighs> yes, father. Sleep now, love. Polonius's voice is creepy. It's like caressing my ears in a way I don't like. Okay, more about get some rest. Nice. Nice. Let's go to Hamlet's rooms. We're right next to Hamlet's rooms. Oh, we're in Laertes. Why did Laertes leave? He was like, well, I better go pack. And then he left his fucking house. Or left his fucking room. Fine. I kind of want to go to Hamlet's. Why is she running? I just feel like she would not be running. Okay. Get some rest. I found Laertes. I did that already. Okay. This is where I see visitors for a chat. People are allowed in her room? Okay, I was like... Seems odd. It's also very nice that she has her own, like, room. Because you would think that she would be just with the... I guess she is the daughter of a duke. And it depends on what castle you're in. Oh, he's bringing the clothes to the ship. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> I, I thought he still had to pack, though. So, like, I was confused. It's completed to it. It has the seal next to it. Okay, I see. The fine Laertes does, right? Yeah. My dresser. With some of my simpler garments I kept. I'm partial to this gown, though, because drawing additional character sprites is expensive. Um, yeah, so this- Oh, I see! It's got the little- Like, it's been stamped! Awesome. Well, time to go to bed. I better rest a while, so... So little happened today! Strong start. Maybe it's all the advice I received. Yeah, that's the joke. Cool. Oh. Oh no! I am having a sad dream about drowning. And I'm seeing the whole plot! Oh. Where everyone I love is dead. Ouch! And also the king. I'm not really partial to. Fucked up. And then I drown. Well, that was a horrible dream. I don't like that at all. Wow, spoilers! Yeah! Goodness. I mean, I guess I'm gonna try to avoid all that. What a strange dream! What the fuck? Is Hamlet in here? Hello? No, Hamlet. This is an invasion of privacy, bro. Get the fuck out of my Ophelia. room. Get the fuck out of my room. Ham Hamlet. No. It, the question is not, is everything all right? It's, get the fuck out of my room. It's not even a question. Oh. 
Ugh. Oh, he saw the fucking ghost. Oh, he saw the fucking ghost last night, and now he's upset. Worms. Worms and wriggling earth. Oh, Christ. Hamlet. Right, because they brought him out to see his, the ghost dad yesterday, and the ghost dad was like, Avenge me! I'm in hell now, but you should listen to me despite that. And thank you! Why are you in my bedchamber? Get the fuck out of my room. I... Oh, okay, he ran away before we could have a productive conversation. Worm reacts only! He ran away before we could have anything like a... Wow, there's several worms. Or oh, that one's like a caterpillar. Caterpillars are generally considered cute. Something's wrong, I would think. Oh. Ow. Why the fuck did I just... Uh-oh. Tragic nightmare. And he's not feeling great. Oh, shit. There's a fucking timer? I don't like that at all. I don't like that. It makes me nervous. I don't like seeing time continue. Okay. Prince Hamlet's madness. What is causing him to act out? I'm gonna talk to these fuckers who are, like, talking about it. Let's go talk to Bernardo! Let's see. I had a terrible nightmare. It felt so real, like it, like a preview. Like a trailer, in fact. <laughs> Going into this game blind was such the right call. I am, uh... Ophelia! Oh, whoa, whoa, okay, not my fucking fault. Why were you watching my door? Father. What? You mustn't. Because he was, he was having a panic attack. Christ, I don't know. He was half clothed. Why was he half clothed? Oh. That wasn't my fault. Oh, no. I can offer some explanation. Ophelia? Ow. I... A vision? Okay, good. I can't wait for you to find out what this game actually is. Fascinating. Oh no. Uh... Be careful. I didn't carry on. Mmm. <laughs> Learns about a future event. If it can happen in this world, it will appear on the timeline. Amazing. Yep. I've gotta try to I've gotta go back to the future. Well, including Hamlet. Oh, shit. Doesn't this kind of, uh, depart from the point of tragedy, though? Isn't the whole tragic thing that, like, it can't, it can't be avoided? Um, okay. Okay, so, holding court at 9.30. Right, they're all there. Oh, wow, it's a Gantt chart. <laughs> okay. Like, can Polonius, like, let me fucking explain? Wait, Hamlet burst Father. into my room and accosted me. I don't want any- I know maybe- Oh, future events are just, like, things she knows about, like, scheduled court events. Okay. So, like, it, it, yeah, it's a Gantt chart. <laughs> Um, it's, I guess it's just like an Outlook scheduler. I can look at everybody's calendar and see who's available for a meeting. Who's available for a one-on-one. -on -one. I know maybe, like, talking to Polonius about Hamlet's mental illness might make things move towards the direction of Claudius making bad decisions, like, thinking about Hamlet is mad and, like, taking action based on that. But I don't want anyone impinging my honor. That's all I have in this day and age. The outlook in Elsinore is grim. That's funny. If multiple things are happening simultaneously, she can only be... I can't wait to meet Rosencrantz or Guildenstern. They're my yes. favorite. Nice. 
I mean, more than usual. He was talking what? about hell and worms. This is about me. Okay, cool. Interesting. Okay, the prince and me. So now I have some information. Okay. I could rekindle the flame if I want it. I don't want that. I'm gonna go talk. Where's Bernardo at? Where's Bernardo at? Hamlet is acting very strange. I'm gonna tell his mom. I'm gonna rat him out to his mom. <coughs> Again? Hmm. Okay, cool. Nailed it. Are you Bernardo? Oh, shit. and Lady Gildenstern. Holy shit! Greetings. Yeah! Yeah! Fascinating. Okay. Now then. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna cure. Can you drown yourself early? I can go check. We'll go see if I can just get that, knock that off the old to-do list. Okay, yes. we're gonna cheer him up with these two. <laughs> All right. Cheer and a little whimsy. That's me. Oh, so Lady Gertrude was going to a scheduled event. <sighs> Uncover the reason for Hamlet's madness. I mean, I get- okay, actually this is helping that make more sense. Because he doesn't know about the go- like, he really doesn't know about the ghosts. He's like, he might- he's asking like, what- uncover the reason that like, Hamlet is like, getting even worse, I guess. Like, what is really making him linger here? Ooh. At once. But then the, he doesn't know that he like, burst into my chambers. It's not spying! Well, it's all the same to us. I, the, the people who made this game are like, I'm gonna shove some more women into this if it kills me. All right, cool, cool, cool. Hi, y'all. Oh, can I? like this at school. Oh. Mm. Farewell. Okay. They now also want to placate. Oh, Rosencrantz and Guildenstern are going to meet each other in private. Can I eavesdrop on them? I want to eavesdrop on them. I'll talk to Marcellus later. I want to ease trouble. I'm just here for Rosencrantz and Guildenstern. Um, what's great about this game is every character is 
always doing stuff. Like, you don't see all of it, but every character's whereabouts are accounted for the entire time. And all of their plans can be disrupted by what you do. That makes me anxious. That makes me really anxious. I don't like that. I, I, I feel like I am both in and out of control. Of course not. I get the hell about it. We do look like spies. Aww. Mm -hmm. Have you played Pentiment? Oh, are you asking Gordian Table? I don't know what that is. No and yes. A mysterious answer. Trust this Ophelia girl. Don't worry about me. I'm just a statue in the distance. Gertrude's having a hard time. Only when I'm on the clock, Feely. Lady Brit's so sassy. Oh no. Pretty disgusting. Pretty disgusting that she's upset about her dead husband? What does that mean? There was a cat? I missed the- Oh, there's a cat! Let's see if we can pet it. <sighs> Let's see if we pet it. I think the river is to the northeast, so. What was I in it? Did I do anything interesting? Oh. No. I love Lady Brit's like, I don't care that everyone died. Was I in it? It's like, no, you're not in the play, bitch. Oh, shit. I was already dead? Christ. Spare me. Amazing. I missed the, like, goodbye. Amazing. She wants to avoid me now. Oh, shit. Cat! Y'all, I am not... I am not gonna do a good job of stopping this chain of tragic events. Like, I am not... Po my political machination level is not high enough. Alright, I guess Laertes left. Let's go out to sea. I wanna go too. Okay. Cool. Alright, I guess I don't get to go. Because I'm a woman, I guess. She's running away from me. It's fine. Where's the guy I'm looking for? Oh, Cory. Oh. Nice. Can I use drop on this? Hamlet. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah! He's dropping! <laughs> Ophelia is already a delight to watch. Yeah, like, 
I, it's really hard to stick to, like, if I'm trying to derail this fucking tragedy, like, I feel like that requires keeping all the subplots in mind. <sighs> Amazing. What I intended to say was, we'd like to, aw, nice. Okay, King <laughs> Claudius, do your best. Wow, Hamlet is ready to... I missed your soliloquy. I saw cats. There's just so much going on. I don't know, man. It's like when you, you're you like your first week of college and you're like, God, there's so many fucking events and I just get, I'm getting FOMO, but I, I'm just going where the wind blows. Hamlet. Aw, I'm making her cry. Oh, Christ. King Claudius, you're not doing very good at reconciliation. I love that no one notices me eavesdropping, though. Aww. I'm, I am kind of, Claudius is like, you need to stop freaking everybody out. Which Goodbye. Is nice. Oh, shit. No. No, you don't fucking do, you don't turn your back on a king. Well, that's a bummer. Are they still busy? Okay, they're chatting. Let's see what their My plan love. is. <sighs> because the sniveling brat. Aww. <sighs> Aww, no. No, Amlet's gonna be a dick about this. I also have bad ADHD, and yet I still strongly recommended this game. Curious. It is fun. This is a very fun concept. I'm just saying, I think everyone is going to die despite my efforts. That is all I'm saying. Aw, uh, man. Okay. Well, what else is going on? What am I supposed to be doing? Oh, I'm trying to figure out why he's being an asshole. So, okay. I just did some things. And now we know Lady Brit is gonna talk to her later, but I don't care. Hamlet! Why are you being an asshole? Hamlet. I... Ophelia. What? Okay. How could what be real? This isn't normal, Stop. you're being a fucking weirdo. Okay. Uh, don't come back where? Aww. Okay. Well, who's over here? <laughs> can I just drown? Nice, the pond! I guess I can't drown myself yet. Time to go to the graveyard! Can I talk to the funny grave digger? Oh, it's got ominous music. Oh. Oh shit! Hamlet's father. Damn. They're all gonna be here together. Okay. Where are the other people, though, is what I'm wondering. Yorick! <laughs> Yorick! Damn. I'm just- I know I'm- I guess I should be doing something plot relevant, but... I'm kind of just enjoying my tour. Okay, so we don't know most. Oh, Mother's Grave. Oh, that's sad. Her name was Elise. I, I always just assume that we don't talk. No, I guess, yeah, we don't talk about Polonius' wife because she's probably dead. Rob a grave? Yes. His name is Yorick. And keep exploring. What important things could possibly be happening elsewhere in Elsinore? Probably nothing. Let's see anybody else who's neat? No. I'm like, I, I'm looking for Marcella's. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Who the fuck are you? Oh. Uh. Hello? Oh, fuck. Oh dear, this won't do. What the fuck just happened? Oh, okay. 
Wow, I am having some bad migraines, y'all. Some really fucking bad migraines. <sighs> what time is it? Did I miss the random event of Lady Brit talking to the queen? Oh, I've been asleep. Okay. Who? Some- t Ah! Peter Quinn's! The play- The play- Players are here! Ophelia. Must be more careful? How was I supposed to be more careful? I was just walking. Like, Father. what do you mean? Like, more Ooh. careful? I can't even go for a walk? Okay, cool. I will thank Quince profusely. I will also talk to him about the show that they're putting on. I'm very excited. Oh, oh, fuck! It's time for the play already? Y'all, shit is moving fast! I've been fucking asleep! It's already time for the play! Oh my god. Okay. Okay, time to go to the fucking play. Holy shit. Oh, cool. I know more things about things now. Okay, I'm at the play. This is very exciting. Is this Peter Quince? It looks like it. Nice. Okay. My lady. Hello. You look like a dweeb, but that's okay. You're an actor. It's fine. Nice. I... Oh! Have you won already? I have not won. Um, but we just got a raid. Wow, very from nice. From Feathers McG. Oh my god, very Jeff, nice. you're thank great. You. Hello, thank you. Raid! We're playing Elsinore? Where we can see if my distracted ass can stop the tragedy of Hamlet from happening. Ray! Thank you, Liari! Oh my gosh, thank you for coming in, guys! Feathers McGee, Raid! Y'all, if you didn't know already, you should follow Feathers McGee and watch more cryptics! Oh, no spoilers, please. This is a blind run, but anyone who is wondering what this game is about can whisper me. Oh, okay, you want to stream this in a bit, so I'm a duck, but you're the best, Riley, and I love you, and I'm so glad to see you. Oh my god, Jeff, thank you. Okay, everyone, make sure you follow Jeff so you can check them out when they stream. That's all. Aw, you're the best, Jeff. I love you, too. Thank you. Yeah, so I guess if you don't want any spoilers, like, get, get the fuck off my stream. Go play this for yourself first. Um, but yeah, I don't know anything about this game. I just know about the play Hamlet, so we're going to see it. In college, uh, we have a tradition at my college of putting on a spoof musical of Hamlet called Hello Hamlet. It's got a it's got a Hello Dolly cover. Um, and I was and every it's put on every two years, every three years I think actually it's like done every certain number of years, and but you rewrite it every time. It's the idea that like every every time it's taken up. To perform, people like tweak the script, and me and some other people did a massive rewrite, and it was super fun. I remember that. Um, oh, I remember my college did a musical comedy version of Titus Andronicus. That's fucking amazing. I bet that was hilarious, because that, that was a slaughter fest. All right, let's see here. I must express my most sincere thanks to you, Please. Sir Quince. The one man thespian? Wait, we don't get the players? It's just Quince doing a one-man show? How is he gonna do the play? Incredible. Incredible. It's just this dude. We didn't wanna... We didn't wanna fucking... Draw more characters, I guess. My favorite was the impromptu edition of I Wanna Hold Your Hand. Cause somebody like eats somebody's hand or something, right? Or chops it off. God, that play is so fucking great. Hand puppets? Is he sponsored by Wilkins Coffee? Oh, maybe. Oh, you're saying maybe. Yeah, also. Peter Quinn's. Maybe he does puppets. Oh my god, maybe he is. Why was he in the graveyard? Is that just the path he walked up? Alright, that's a creepy thing to say, Quinn's. Gold puppets? Yeah, it was right after a big handing. Nice. I want to hold your hand, but not when it's still connected to you. It is rather disarming when one's mortal coil fails one, isn't it? <laughs> Jesus Christ, Quince. On that topic, have you been to Elsinore before? That's what a segue. 
Spools are so expensive. I remember this conversation, Gordian Dangle. Coincidence, perhaps, or fate? Amazing. Okay. I mean, I don't know, man. Events are moving pretty fast. I'm pretty sure we're just gonna die. There are fascinating things at work in Elsinore Castle. Do I get to time travel? I hope so. Is it the time machine? Is the time machine what has been set in motion? What is Quince is being the a weirdo? Hmm. Huh. All right. What the fuck was that? Hey man, I had a strange nightmare. Can you explain it? You're being a fucking weirdo about it. I see. An ill omen. Yeah. What shall I do about it? Apparently, go sit, go pet a cat at the docks. Hamlet. Bernardo! You were the one I wanted to talk to, bitch. What's wrong with Hamlet? What Listen. the fuck happened? What the fuck? I blame you. I heard you and Marcellus talking about shit. No. What do you mean it's nothing? Don't fucking lie to me, Don't Bernardo. Yes, I have told him. Oh my god. No, it's... He's not a danger to me yet. I would say he's a danger. Bernardo, tell me what's happening. I... Oh. Interesting. He's telling me to go to the library? Oh. Interesting. Bernardo. Huh. Intriguing. I wonder if... The... I'm gonna find out that, like, King Hamlet was also insane. Would that make his ghost crazy, though? A death? Oh, it's just the death report. Okay, we're gonna see, like, how he died. Alright, let's watch a play! The play's the thing, y'all. Welcome, one and all. Very exciting. Very exciting. I am here for this. Nice. Let's stir some shit up if this is what normally happens. My many changing places. I aim to please all who look upon me. A tale the tragic. murder of Gonzago. Oh, this is gonna be awkward. I like that we all just stand here. Hmm. I don't think we've seen this one before. Hmm. You have. You have though. <laughs> oh no, Hamlet, no. Not good. I'm glad I am a master fucking eavesdropper. Ladies and gentlemen. Makes this. Okay, cool. Huh. Oh. Oh, fuck. He puts on masks. Okay. Fair enough. Terrifying. Huh. My form is weak and frail. Ha ha ha. A new husband you shall find. Ooh. Aw. Okay. Incredible! What does that mean, love? Wow, I can't even delete my own messages as a mod. Fuck that. Just like inscription. What are you saying? You want me to delete it? I don't know if I can. Can I delete it? I can ban you. I don't know how to delete this. I'm trying to figure out how to. I can pin it. Nope. All, all I know how to do is reply. Which ones do you want gone? Did you accidentally leave your, leave your Russian keyboard on or something, honey? Oh, were you trying to talk to your family? Oh, you just accidentally left the keyboard on? 
Is that even Russian, or is that just gobbledygook because you were typing in English, but the Russian happened? <laughs> yeah, if you could delete the Russian from the chat, Gordian Tangle, we would appreciate it. Naturally, Gonzago's even brother has something more sinister in mind. Incredible! Ha! <coughs> wow. Incredible! Oh, you also- maybe you can't delete a mod's messages. Maybe, like, you just can't. So that's kind of weird. I can't even. So you guys have a lot of power. You can say whatever you want. Her. Oh my god, rude. This is so fucking awkward. It makes me- like, this is making me really oh. mad at Hamlet. Like, this- presentation of this is making me really mad at Hamlet. What do you call this play again? <laughs> I I cannot recall. Do they seem nervous? Do they actually seem nervous though? Oh my dear. I don't know. Oh. <gasps> Gordian Tangle! Thank you for the Prime subscription! Holy shit, thank you so much for the resub. That is awesome. Exploiting the murder of your own father for content. You turning turning your dad's death into a into a fucking TikTok. Is that like modern day Hamlet? You like make a TikTok to like subtweet at your mom. Or 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 new who prime subscriber. Like any true content producer, every event is a chance for content. My love, why are your lips so pale? Oh, uh -oh. oh shit, his mask changed. That's neat. Is he just like really quickly like... What is this? Uh, Queen Claudius is like... I, who, who authorized it? Like I just heard there was a play going on. Someone should have run this by me. Man, let's stop this. Wait. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! I love that I could, like, probably just go take a nap instead of go to this. Like, if I wanted to, I could just not see any of this, I think. Unless the game, like, makes you, like, maybe this is something that you have to, like, watch. But that's pretty funny. You fully can? That makes me so happy. <laughs> oh, no! Ooh. To the altar, we must hurry! Bro! Oh. This is uncomfortable. Oh. This guy's a jerk. Oh. What do you think, mother? <laughs> Hamlet? God, you're such a fucking little whiny edgelord. I mean, I don't know, maybe I'm gonna do research and find out they actually did murder the king. But then it's gonna be like, oh, this was not the right way to handle this. <laughs> the lady protests too much. Girl, good for you, Gertrude. Stop. Oh, shit. <sighs> I need to leave? Claudius, dude, you gotta keep your cool. Claudius. I feel ill? Yeah, I mean, I'm just saying. Looks a little suspicious, bro. Cancel the play? I mean, the worst part's already happened, man. My lord. The entire play? Was there more? <laughs> what else was left? It wasn't a very good play, to be fair. No, it's just this one dude throwing these masks on and being like, Ah, oh, I cannot love another after Gonzago. Like, that's not the best writing I've ever heard. Cancel the entire play. I, I DK, we can't see how dope these masks are. Yeah, I guess maybe they're like way cooler than it seems like in this little window here. Well, that was odd. <laughs> Queen Gertrude's like, shut the fuck up. All right, everyone, we're gonna go have some snacks. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Bro, what a, I'm so, like, I just feel like that's such like a womanly move. Like I just really relate to Gertrude in this moment that like, her boo has just made this party really fucking awkward. Like, they were all supposed to, like, watch this. Um, and then she's just like, no, we're gonna go eat some fucking snacks. 
for fuck's sake, shut up and eat your organs. Yeah, she's like, nothing to worry about. Like, she's like, we're just going to go to the other room and we're going to smooth over this social faux pas. I knew it. You knew fucking nothing, Amlet. You just made him uncomfortable. Oh, a spirit? What the fuck is that about? I saw it too. Oh? I'm gonna pursue him? For some reason, Claudius was deeply upset by that play. Because it's about, like, his brother died. Like, it's clearly about, like, pointing fingers at him. Like, it is possible that Claudius was just uncomfortable without actually being a murderer. But it is possible he's a murderer, so, you know. I guess we'll find out. Becomes upset, but will recover overnight. He's gonna be fine tomorrow. He does not want to play Kate Hamlet. He wants to avoid Hamlet. Oh, shit. They all believe now that the play targets Claudius, and Ophelia learns about an event in which he seeks salvation. Hamlet! Do I try to talk to him? Maybe I could tell him about my nightmare, and I can be like, listen, if you don't stop being a fucking asshole, everyone's going to die. Uh, a nightmare? I guess I shouldn't give him- maybe I'm just giving him the ideas right now? And that's probably a, a mistake. Uh, not great. My father! You saw my father? Never mind, doesn't matter. I need to be alone. No, you don't. You're just gonna fuck it. I'm- we're, okay, no, I don't want- No, wait, let me click on Hamlet! Let me click on Hamlet! No, no, wait. No. No! Fuck! Where is he? Fuck, where is he? Where'd he go? Is this sad boy? Sad boy! Wait, which one did I click on? Fuck. Fuck. Follow. I hope I clicked on him. Let's see. Yes! Okay. Nice! Queen, Cla Queen Claudius is upset. He doesn't know how to pray for forgiveness. Or dissolve. Nice! Nani's drop! Oh, my offense is rank. Oh, it shit. smells to heaven. Hmm. Oh, shit. I killed him. Oh! Oh, okay. He just did it. We just know that he did it. I think that in, in the play Hamlet, it is left up a little bit more to interpretation. Uh, my thoughts rise up, but my words remain below. Words without thoughts ne'er to heaven go. Is the actual line from this scene. Words without, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't think he's like, I, like, he makes it, he seems like he is feeling guilty, but it is possible that he just feels guilty for taking over his brother's place. Like, it's a little bit looser. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, he just, okay, he just did it. He just fucking did it. He did the murder. Okay. Well, that simplifies things. I could see no other way out. Oh. So abdicate, you dingus. <laughs> um. Yeah, but he's also saying he saw no other way out. I wonder if there was something wrong with King Hamlet. Like, if King Hamlet was mad, like, was mad. And that's, I wonder, like, if we're just saying King Claudius just straight up killed him, it makes me think that there's gonna be some justification. Like, if I go look at that book that, uh, Bernardo pointed me towards, like, I feel like I'm gonna learn some reason that he should be, like, that, that it not, if not, like, vindicated, like, a little understandable. That it's not just, no. like, his greed. Yeah, Hamlet. Well, now Murder. you know. Oh shit. Oh god. 
Okay, I have a lot of information now. Uh, okay. King Claudius. <laughs> why would he do that? So now, I, yeah, see, now I have to, like, figure out, like, why the fuck? Why did he do that? Oh, great. And I also know more about Prince Hamlet's madness. So, somebody told me to go read a book. wondering like where he got so I know that I have undeniable proof well I mean that I heard him say it I guess so I should probably go talk to Gertrude about it um oh no is he gonna fucking kill him can I like stop him oh, okay this is the moment where Hamlet is like that's okay, you have a lot of time to solve this mystery, probably. Or like a day. I'm pretty sure things move pretty fast in the play. He confessed to murdering my father, I should kill him. If I do it now while he's praying, he'll go to heaven. So I can't do it now. Oh. Amazing. Now he doesn't want to investigate him, he wants to- Oh, and like the game is keeping track of like everybody's motives. And like to each other. Um. Okay, this is a really- I'm just like, I, okay. I think I have to cut. I have to, I have to stop for tonight. This is really fun. I'm enjoying this game a lot. Thank you for the recommendation, Guardian Tangle. We'll be back next week with more Cryptics and more Elsinore. We're going to see if I can stop the tragedy of Denmark. Um, I doubt that I can, but this is fun. It's fun to be eavesdropping on all the conversations. It's like, um, going to sleep no more when they like do the immersive it i wonder if it was like that that kind of inspired this i will say you ain't seen nothing yet yeah i had no idea that this existed but this is really neat yeah it seems like i'm waiting for some big fucking plot like peter quince was like really weird really weird about it i also really enjoy the music um but i'm gonna cut stream because it has been three hours and i really have to pee and i was trying to get uh like, I was trying to get to, a, like, a good stopping point. <laughs>